that's the closest yet. It's a lovely day again, it's a bit hazy on the horizon but really nice day and you don't know how many more of these we've got to come so I was out yesterday and had such a good time I've come back today to try again. There do you believe me now? That's only about five metres off the boat. That's the closest yet. Right, I'm getting near the rocks here. Oh, there you are as well. Hello. Right, that's all from me because it's picking up, it's getting a bit rough and I'm almost on the rocks here, so I'm off. It's uh, just after half past 12. High tide is 10 to 3. Um, so it's about mid tide now. And uh, there's virtually no wind. I think it's three miles an hour wind. Uh, one to two foot well and foot waves but doesn't even look that but I'm looking towards the lighthouse and I can see white water so I think it's probably a little bit worse over there but I think I'll head over and um, water's crystal clear and I can see the bottom from here and um, I'm quite a way out well I'm not quite a way out I'm, I'm 100, 150 yards off the, the shore. Uh, I was talking to somebody yesterday who recommended to me if you want to see the seals, bring some sandwiches with you and a drink and sit and they'll come to you. So 
I got some sandwiches today. Sandwiches. It's really warm, but it's it's not so sunny as it was yesterday. But I think after tomorrow, the weather's uh, not going to be so good. So you have to make the most of it and get out and do things when you can. If uh, anybody's seen me for the first time, I normally do videos about camper vans. I'm converting a, a Citroen Relay a panel van into a camper van and um, at the minute most of my videos are about that so I'll get back that, to that tomorrow so, uh, I'm still doing them um, there's one nearly finished actually I'll uh, get back into the garage tomorrow and crack on with that but Tomorrow's another day. I'm kayaking today. Well, we've been spotted. There's a couple of little heads popped up. Um, I can't really see what I'm filming here. Um, but we've been spotted. So, uh, there was a splash just behind me there. I don't know if that was a seal or not. The tide's not that far in yet because people are still going across to the island and when the tide's in you can't get across to the island so uh, it's uh, five to one it's another two hours yet for the, before high tide I used to dive here many years ago and uh, there always was some funny tides and currents around here so um, I'm always a bit wary well, it's time for sandwiches, I think. It's dinner time. Oh, there's a seal just over there as well. Not normally on that side. We're normally between the lighthouse now, but he's, uh, he's looking this way. Wonder if he likes chili chicken sandwiches. Well, there's quite a few heads popping up around me, but they're all quite a distance off. But well, I haven't been here very long. There's a the one there. I hope you can make him out. I think he's asleep. He's been there for ages. And he doesn't seem to be moving. He's just bobbing up and down. I think he's asleep. There he is. But he looks... He, he's only about 25 yards away. He probably looks further in the camera. But he's never moved. He just he's just sitting there having a nap in the sun. He's sunbathing. Can't blame him, it's lovely. I didn't realise that his boat had sneaked up behind me. I mean I can't see him in the camera. Where is he? Oh, I mean, there he is. He's closer than he looks on the camera. I wonder if that will frighten the seals or attract the seals. It's getting busy around here now. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine boats around here. Well, they're further out than me. Brian, if you're watching, you are right. The water does come through the handles. It's just sucked me bum. Not much though. That seal's still asleep. I don't know if you can see him on the camera. There he is. Cameraman's hopeless, isn't he? It's a bit bobby though. 
it's hard to keep the camera still. Gets any worse, you'll be seeing me uh, chili chicken sandwiches again. <laughs> I'm absolutely amazed at that seal. He's been asleep, Bob, just like that for half an hour. He's never moved. That's where I came in. Looks a long way off from here. Looks awfully misty as well. Can't see the horizon. can't see anything just my own reflection in the stream so I'm pointing the camera in the wrong direction my apologies don't know if you can make out that jellyfish that's a very small one uh, you get them oh, six times that size um, and there's loads never noticed them before any other year but this year there's loads of them and as I say, that's a tiny little one, they're normally bigger. Talking away there, I forgot to turn the camera on. It's because I can already see what's going on in the screen for the reflections. And uh, I thought I'd turned it, turned it on and I hadn't. And I'm talking away there. I was trying to show you my mate there, he's still asleep. He's, uh... Oh well, I'm saying, I'm saying my mate there, I hope I'm pointing the camera at him. I still can't see what I'm taking. He's a weight of the world, isn't he? He must have a late night. Hello, you woke up there. There you go. Hello. Oh, come and see us, man. I'm starting to get a bit concerned for it because it's it's got to be nearly an hour now and it's it's just lying there. I was starting to wonder if it was maybe he's hurt, but that uh, fishing boat's just gone past and it raised up out of the water, yawned, shook its head, and then and it's looking around now. It's quite alert. It's not. Uh, I don't think it's ill or hurt in any way. It's just sleepy. Oh, he's gone. He's start. He's woke up. Right, he might go a bit closer now. Yeah, he's fine. He moved around from there to about there for a little while, and then he dozed off again. Um, only a couple of minutes, and now he's gone right over there beside the waves. I'm seeing him. I think it's the same one. He's, he seems to be the only one out here now. Um, but he obviously doesn't want to con any contact with me, so I'm not chasing him around. I'll, um, I'm going to a bit closer to that cement post. That's where I seen some the other day, yesterday. Uh, I'll have a look over there, but I don't think I don't think there's many in today. Well, I don't know. If I'm pointing the camera in the right way, and if you can see, but I'm next to the cement post now, a lot nearer. Well, not a lot, 100, 150 yards closer to the uh, rocks than I was before. Um, this is where they all were yesterday. There was quite a few here yesterday. Oh, there's one just behind me. Can you see him? And he's looks like he's swimming over to see me. Ah, oh, he's gone. I was just going to say, I'm going to have my uh, rest of my sandwiches and then if none of them show their face, I might uh, have a slow paddle back. It's after two o'clock now. Not that I'm complaining, it's lovely. Um, but yeah, I'll have, my, um, I'll have the rest of my sandwiches and see if uh, any seals come over and then I might start heading back. I think he's just playing with me, he knows when I turn the camera off. It shows that I'm not stressing him out though, because he's he couldn't care less that I was here. Just seen three sea kayaks going into the bay, but they went over the 
causeway so it must be deep enough to get across there now it looks a bit rough there's a bit white water there but um, they didn't hesitate so they went straight straight across so I might have a little look across there and see if I can get across um, if I'm in doubt I probably won't right we'll go across to the causeway and have a look see see what it looks like see if uh, I don't know whether this kayak might be sitting lower than theirs and might hit the rocks I don't know I'm a bit wary about going through but we'll have a look uh, I've been here probably two and a half hours now nice way to spend two and a half hours I'm not complaining uh, well yeah, I'm just wondering when the next time I get to come out here. Might be, might be next year now. Hope not. It's lovely. Well, I'm nearly at the causeway now. Over there. I don't know if you can see or not. But it looks like there's quite a current going across the causeway. Probably because the tide's coming in. I don't know. Um, but I don't think I'll bother. I don't really want to go there that much and if you look from the other way you see the sea frets coming in but there's a boat there that you could see really clearly before can't see it now and to see the outline of it you probably can't see it at all so the sea fret is uh looks like it's coming in it looks pretty thick not that that would affect me i don't think i'm not that far off offshore but no I don't think so I might just have a little slow relaxing paddle back it'll be about three o'clock by the time I get back it'll be high tide by the time I get back because it'll take me nearly 20 minutes half an hour to, to get back to the uh, part of the beach where I came in I might even go in for a swim when I get back. It's really warm. And I'm back to the garage tomorrow to carry on with the camper van conversion. So, if you've enjoyed today, you might like to see my camper van videos. hit the subscribe button don't forget to click that bell icon and you'll be reminded whenever I release a video